Good evening. Hello, good evening. Hi, teacher. Hello, hello, Veronica. How are you? Hi. And you? All right. Ready, ready for another class. Ready, ready class. Okay, good. Okay, okay. Where do you work, for, uh, Veronica? Excuse me, excuse me? Where do you work? Ah, no work. Ah, you don't work? Okay. No, Just only student, oh. only student. <laughs> all right, very good, nice. So you have to, you have to be busy all the time. Okay, let's get coming in. Okay, okay. I'm gonna wait one more minute to see who will join the join the, the class so that we can start. We have to move this way. <clears throat> Hello, good evening. Hi, Esther. Good evening, teacher. Hello, Griselda. Grisela. Right? Yes, Grisela. All right. Yes, Grace. Teacher. Hello, Esther, Anna. How are you? Good evening. Hello, Alan. Good evening. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Okay, we have today 12 participants. Okay, good. Okay, so we think we can start now. The future. Okay, there you go. The future will be going to. Yes. That's going, correct. Going okay, so today we're going to have, uh, yesterday we were talking about the, the future with going to. Good evening. Hello, good evening. Entonces, repollo hizo? ¿Cuántas zanahorias metió? Entonces, usted sabe cuánto cortó eso, pero no sabe qué cantidad le va a echar. Good evening, teacher. Hello, good evening. I have a question, eh, exercise uno, eh, one, mm -hmm. eh, one eleven. Uh -huh. eh, solamente apaguen los micrófonos, por favor, si no están participando para que no tengamos interferencia, ¿ok? All right, Saúl. Ajá, uh -huh. what's the question? Ajá, uh Saúl. -huh. Exercise one. Eh... Eh, section one, perdón. Uh -huh. section, section one, exercise one, eh, eleven. Ah, one eleven, huh? But we are in one, three or four, I guess, in this moment, right? Okay. What is your question? Eh, hay, te, hay una, eh, ¿cómo le dijera? Una, 
es en, en una oración de que no, no, ¿cómo le dijera? Digo en tú. No la, no la logro eh, corregir. Uh -huh. Ah, ok. Entonces le he hecho de, de varias formas y siempre me da error. Sí, debe haber algún punto, una coma o algo, que, o algún espacio. Ok, ya vamos okay. a verlo, ok. Ok. At the end, thank you. Ok, good. Now we have uh, this, this one. Uh, this is what we did yesterday. Eh, se oye ruido ahí, ¿quién es? Usted silencia los micrófonos, ya, sí. Sí, ya, ya lo, ya lo detecté. Muchas gracias. Okay, this is what we were studying yesterday, right? We're going to. No, they aren't. And the examples we I show, I'll show you. Then today we have a knowledge check here. It's a listening, okay? In this listening, okay, you're going to first listen and look at the pictures and look at these questions. What are these people going to do? Okay, then you have the names. What are the names? Michelle, Kevin, Robert, and Jane. Okay, now first only listen. I'm talking with people waiting for the bus tonight. I'm finding out how they're going to spend their evening. What's your name? It's Michelle. I bet you're going to go to the gym tonight. No, not tonight. I'm going to meet a friend. We're going to run together in the park. And what's your name? Kevin. Are you going home now, Kevin? No, not right now. First, I'm going to go to the video game arcade. Oh, so you're going to play video games. Yeah, I am. Can I ask your name? Yes, my name's Robert. Are you going to do anything interesting tonight? Well, my friend Chris is going to have a party, but I'm going to work at home. I have all my work right here in my briefcase. So you can't go to the party. You're going to work tonight. That's right. And what's your name? I'm Jane. Do you have any plans for this evening? I just bought some new CDs, so I'm going to listen to music tonight. What kind of music is it? Jazz. I always listen to jazz. Okay. Now, look at these sentences. Okay, Michelle is going to. Then look at the four possibilities. Kevin is going to. Robert is going to, and Jane is going to. So what we have to do is what each person is going to do, okay? So then uh, listen again, and now when after we listen for the second time, so you are going to tell me which activity or which of this, uh, uh, yes, activities are they planning to do? Now listen again. Good evening. I'm Al Rivers with KXQ News Radio. I'm talking with people waiting for the bus tonight. I'm finding out how they're going to spend their evening. What's your name? It's Michelle. I bet you're going to go to the gym tonight. No, not tonight. I'm going to meet a friend. We're going to run together in the park. And what's your name? Kevin. Are you going home now, Kevin? No, not right now. First, I'm going to go to the video game arcade. Oh, so you're going to play video games. Yeah, I am. Can I ask your name? Yes, 
My name's Robert. Are you going to do anything interesting tonight? Well, my friend Chris is going to have a party, but I'm going to work at home. I have all my work right here in my briefcase. So you can't go to the party. You're going to work tonight. That's right. And what's your name? I'm Jane. Do you have any plans for this evening? I just bought some new CDs, so I'm going to listen to music tonight. What kind of music is it? Jazz. I always listen to jazz. Okay. What about Michelle? What is Michelle going to do? Meet our friend. Meet our friend. Meet our friend. What about Kevin? Play video game. 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 Robert is going to work at home. Work at home. Work at home. Work at home. All right. Jane is going to listen to music. Listen to music. That's correct. Okay, hey, very good. Now let's see. Okay, mm. this one is correct. This one's music. Three is correct. Number two is correct. And also number one. Okay. Good. So all of them are gonna submit it here. 33 points out of 33. Okay. Don't forget to turn off your phone, please. So that we don't have interference. Okay. All right, good. Okay, so then now we have this lesson objective. By the end of this class, we will learn how to use natural uh, sound natural when we're talking about future plants by reducing going to. Okay, now we're gonna use the pronunciation, okay, before we go to the practice. Listen, pay attention. This is, uh, for example, we say going to, okay? ¿Cómo lo decimos en español? Ir a. Ir a. Ir a o... Voy. Ah? Huh? Voy a. Ajá, uh -huh. voy a. Voy a. Right? Exactly, voy a, All right? Good. And then, eh, ir, ¿cómo lo decimos en buen salvadoreño? Huir. Okay. All right. Okay. Por qué les digo esto? Porque algo así van a ver acá. Okay. Uh, what is the correct? What is the form that we use in English? Going to. Going, going to. Uh -huh. Going to. Uh -huh. Who's it gonna? Gonna. 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 You say Janet. Janet. Yes. Yes. Okay. Good. All right. Now you're gonna hear gonna. Okay. Now. Apaguen sus micrófonos para que puedan. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Now listen. Hi there. In this class, you learn how to sound natural when talking about future plants by reducing be going to. Let's start by listening to the pronunciation of going to. Reduction of going to. Are you going to have a party? Okay. That's it, right? Are you going to have a party? This is the reduction. No, are you going to have a party? Okay. Ba, okay. Are you going to have a ba? Okay. That's the, the way that we use it. Okay. Sorry. Good. No, I'm going to go out with a friend. Are you going to go to a restaurant? Yes. We're going to go to Nick's Cafe. When spoken, going to is usually going to sound as gonna. Let's analyze the examples one more time. Are you going to have a party? No, I'm going to go out with a friend. Are you going to go to a restaurant? Yes, we're going to go to Nick's Cafe. As I mentioned in a previous class in which I talked about pronunciation, pronunciation is one of the most difficult to learn in English. 
and this is because there are many exceptions to rules that we may mention. The best way to learn pronunciation is by listening carefully and repeating. Today's topic is quite universal, and if you watch your favorite TV program in English, you'll hear gonna instead of going to. So I would like for you to do just that. Watch your favorite TV program in English and pay attention to how going to is pronounced. And if you watch your favorite, and this is because sound as gonna. Let's analyze the examples one more time. Are you gonna have a party? Okay. So that's why they it, they call it reduction, right? Because when you say, are you gonna have a party? Sounds like we speak fast, okay? Por eso es que algunas veces dicen, no, fíjese, teacher, que yo no entiendo. A veces no es que no entendamos. A veces lo que sucede es que nuestro oído no está acostumbrado a decodificar esos sonidos, ¿verdad? Entonces, es como cuando nosotros hablamos español bien, bien, este, bien salvadoreño, como decimos, yo le diga, espérenme, voy a ver. No es lo mismo que le diga, permítame, voy a ir a ver. Right? And then, eh, eh, imagínese usted, le dice a un extranjero, que, el micrófono, por favor. Ok, suponga que usted le dice a un extranjero que está aprendiendo español, espérenme, voy a ver. ¿Cree que le entendería? No. Tal vez no. O sea, entonces sería bien difícil. Entonces, a veces eso nos sucede a nosotros como inglés, ¿verdad? Por eso es que es muy bueno ponerse a, a practicar mucho el idioma con, con el oído, viendo, como dice acá en el ejemplo, eso en No, I'm going to go out with a friend. No, I'm going to go out with a friend. Are you going to go to a restaurant? Are you going to go? Are you going to go? Are you going to go to a restaurant? Are you going to go to a restaurant? Yes. We're going to go to Nick's Cafe. Okay. Yes. We're going to go to Nick's Cafe. Okay. You know that dicen, in... Si lo dicen de corrido, obviamente no, no lo vamos a entender. Pero si lo, lo dijesen despacito, a lo mejor... Mm -hmm. Exacto. Y posiblemente le entendemos. Exacto, pero cuando ya estamos en el hablado, por eso es que muchas veces ya en la práctica, la vida real, no sí. le van a dar despacio. Entonces, no, claro. Pero si usted se acuerda si de eso, uh, we're gonna, a, a, a decirlo, a pronunciarlo, entonces también su articulación y su oído se van acostumbrando a eso. Ok, entonces eso es parte de mucha práctica. Entonces, that's why, yes, we're gonna go. Por ejemplo, aquí, next cafe. Listen to this, cafe. Yeah, yo lo voy a decir, querido, please, querido, please. As I mentioned in a previous part. You can say, slowly, please, slowly, please. Uh -huh. Yes, slowly. Slowly. Which I talked about pronunciation. Pronunciation is one of the most difficult to learn in English. Okay, pronunciation is what's the most difficult to learn in English. And this is because there are many exceptions to rules that we may mention. The best way to learn pronunciation is by listening carefully and repeating. Okay, so the best way is listening carefully and repeating. Listening, so this is something like listen and imitate, right? Listen and imitate. Okay, then uh, one more seven challenge. Today's topic is quite universal, and if you watch your favorite TV program in English, you'll hear gonna instead of going to. So I would like for you to do just that. Watch your favorite TV program in English and pay attention. Okay, you see you have to watch your TV program, Friends, I don't know, TV series in English, and then you're going to listen to this kind of transition, but a challenge. Vamos a hacer un reto. Okay? ¿Quién se atreve a decirme esta dos de acá? Like, are you going to have a party? No, I'm not going to go out with a friend. Quickly, right? Are you going to have a party? 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 Are you going to have a party?
party. Okay. And you guys oh, yeah. have the party. I'm gonna go. Oh, yeah. Begin with, 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 with Yesenia, okay? Okay, the rest, uh -huh. listen to this. Mm -hmm. The rest. Okay. Turn off, turn off your microphones. Apagan los micrófonos, turn off your mic y practiquen. Y yo voy a decir unos nombres acá y me van a decir esta. Uh -huh. okay. Okay. Are you going to have a, listen, are you going to have a party? Are you going to have a party? No. I'm going to go, I'm going to go, I'm going to go out with a friend. No, I'm going to go out with a friend. You can have a party? No, I'm going to go out with a friend. Okay, you said. Okay. Are you going to have a party? No, I'm going to go out with a friend. Okay, no problem, no problem. <laughs> No, I'm gonna, I I'm am gonna go out. I'm no, gonna go I am. Out. No, I am a go out okay. with a friend. I'm gonna go out. No, I I I I'm, go. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. I am gonna go out with a friend. Okay, good. Let me check. Let me see something. Let me, let me, let me, let me. Can I guess here? I'm gonna go out. Uh -huh. Out. With with a friend. Okay. Okay. Okay, Veronica. Okay. Her are person. you gonna have? Are you gonna have a party? No, I am gonna. Oh, I am gonna go oh, with a friend. Okay. I'm gonna go out with a friend. No, I'm gonna go out with a friend. With a friend. Okay. This is sound. This is you know how uh, how it will sound for us probably. Using the our language, right? Okay, Nancy. No, I'm gonna go. Nancy, Nancy Guillen, Nancy Guillen, are you? Are you gonna have a party? No, I am gonna go out with a friend. Okay, good. Uh, sir. Yes, I spent. The suit. Uh, with a friend. Are you gonna? La primera. Hmm. Are you gonna to have a party? The second? Um, no, I'm gonna with a friend. I'm gonna go out with a friend. Okay, good. I'm gonna go with a friend. With a friend. Sa uh, Saul, this too. Are you going to? Are you, going are, you going to, are you going to have a party? No, I am going to go out with a friend. I'm going to go out with a friend. Okay, good. Okay, Vladimir, the other two. Are you going to go to a restaurant? Yes, we're going to go to Nick's Cafe. Are you going to go to a restaurant? Yes, I. We, we're going to go to a Nick's Cafe. With a friend, okay. Fabiola, this too. Maria, el de, the restaurant. Yes. Yes, yes, Are yes. you going to, are you going to, are you gonna, are you gonna, are you gonna go to a restaurant? Yes. We are gonna go to Nix, Nix Cafe. Eh? Nix Cafe. Okay, good. Okay, no problem if you don't do it fast, okay? Aquí lo importante no es si lo haces rápido. Recuerden que no es por hablar rápido que uno habla mejor inglés. Es la pronunciación, okay? Ustedes van a hablar, la velocidad de inglés que ustedes van a tener es la misma que ustedes puedan tener en español. Okay? Yo por general hablo, hablo rápido en español, lo mismo me sale en inglés, pero no es porque, ah, o sea, eh, en inglés lo hablo más rápido, no. Es just... Uh, Cuestión de ya uno es lo habla de esa manera. Okay. Good. Uh, now, questions. 
gonna, remember, okay? Gonna, going to is gonna. Now here's the answer to the following questions. Aquí les dejé unos posts, okay? Ya vi que ya están algunos respondiendo acá. Respondan ahí el, eh, algunas preguntas que les he dejado. Creo que son 10 preguntas que les puse. Eh, what are you going to do? Okay, so that you can practice. For example, I'm going to do my homework. Are you going to do, are you going to do the cleaning? Okay, yes, I am going to wash the dishes. Okay. Yes, wait a minute. Okay. Just let me. This is about holidays. Okay. Take a look. Okay, Lisbeth, can you read the first question and the answer? Number one. Uh -huh. He's gonna to be her is in his work. Hours, okay. When is she gonna be there? Cuando va a estar ahí? She's gonna be there in a few hours. Va a estar ahí unas cuantas horas, okay? Uh, Janet de Marín, right? Where? The number two. Where is, where is she going to go? She's going to. She's gonna go to the go to the to the store. To the store, okay. She's gonna go to the store. Good. She's going to the store. Uh, Steve, number three. How how are you gonna to get to work? I'm gonna to take the bus to the work to work. Okay. Remember that gonna include two. Okay. Mm -hmm. How are you gonna get to work? How are you gonna get to work? I'm gonna, okay, I'm gonna take the bus to work. All right? Uh, Claudia, Claudia Ramos, four. Why is she gonna be late? Why is she gonna be late, uh-huh. She's gonna be late because his car isn't working. Okay, very good, excellent. Okay, Eliezer, number five. How much, how much are they gonna pay for the furniture? Very good. They are gonna pay uh, 2000. Uh, 2000. <laughs> To house them for their furniture. Very good, Eliezer. Good, good, good. Excellent. Okay, Senia. Senia Garcia. Chin. Number six. Where is Jenny gonna to leave? Which time? Okay, mm -hmm. gonna leave. Where is Jenny gonna leave? I'm gonna to start. Jenny is, go is gonna live in Chicago. Perfect, okay. Jenny is gonna live in Chicago. Okay, Osmaro. One more, one more. Michael. Who are you going to go out with tonight? Mm -hmm. I'm gonna go out with my friend tonight. Very good, 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 good. Okay, Yesenia Carvajal. Okay. And what mm -hmm. is, what is he going to, to do? Okay. He doesn't know what he's going to do. Okay, he doesn't know what he's going to do. Okay, Ulysses, number nine. What time is, she, is the movie gonna start? Okay. I don't know what time the movie is gonna start. It's gonna start, excellent, very good, very good. Okay, it is Montano. Where are, they, where are they gonna finish the project? Finish the project. Mm -hmm. They're going. 
they're gonna finish the project by next week. Okay, so I have another one here, but uh, right now, okay, we're going to, okay, we're going to work in groups. We have uh, 24 people. I think we're gonna have like six groups of four, okay? When you get to the groups, I want you to practice two questions, okay? The first, well, many questions, but the first question is, when is your birthday, okay, remember? My birthday is on December 22nd, okay? My birthday is on June 6th, on June 6th right? And the other one, the other questions that you are going to practice is, are you going to have a party tonight? Are you going to play soccer? Remember, just no question, just in going to. Okay. For example, are you gonna are you gonna eat pupusas tonight? Okay. Are you gonna eat pupusas tonight? Are you gonna uh, are you gonna have hamburgers tonight? Are you gonna cook uh, are you gonna cook lasagna tomorrow? Okay. Are you gonna read a book this weekend? So all these kind of questions using different verbs, like the examples I. I uh, I send to the to the to the chat right so similar to that questions similar to that just no question then you go on, you are going to say yes I am or no I am not okay, okay. well I will make the groups and I will visit the groups uh, to see if you have any questions okay let me see we have five groups six groups here we go. Uh, receive the invitation and accept it. Eso es lo que le dije yo ayer. Sí. Le voy bien. Vamos a hacer preguntas de acuerdo al ejemplo que nos dieron. Porque no nos han dado imagen, solo es de lo que estamos practicando. Ok, you can practice the questions when, when is your birthday, right? Real questions. Remember, you can use uh, Kenya. When is your birthday? Sorry. When is your birthday? My birthday is on October six. On October six. October six. <laughs> okay, very good. Okay, my birthday is on October six. Then you can ask uh, Kenya. You can ask Vladimir. Vladimir, when is your birthday? Okay, Vladimir, answer okay. the question. And you can change the date. Pueden ir cambiando la fecha para practicar más, right? Okay. And after that, and after that, you can, uh, you ask question of, for example, Vladimir, are you going to play video games tonight? Don't. But it's you. Yes? No, no. No, no, I'm not. No, I I'm am not. not. Okay. okay. Uh, we can say, uh, Claudia, um, are you going to dance uh, on Friday? No, I am not. No, I am not. Okay. So you can, are you going to, uh, are you going to run, uh, Kenya, are you going to to drive uh, a car tomorrow? No, I am not. No, I'm not. Okay. So you can use when okay. is your birthday in questions with are you going to. Okay. Got it. Okay. 
Okay, perfect. Okay, practice. When is your birthday? My birthday is in October 24th. In... Perdón. Hi, on, ju on, ju on July 25th. ¿Qué tal? Okay. No le escuché. No problem. No le escuché, Steven. Sorry. On July 26th. Ok. Teacher, una pregunta. Ajá. Uh -huh. Siempre, siempre va a ir el tú, ¿verdad? ¿El? Tú. Tú, uh, are you going to? Yes. Uh -huh. Are you going to work? Are you gonna? Eh, cuando se dice gonna, no se oye, pero ahí está. Are you gonna go? Are you going to go? Yes. Are you going to stay? Are you gonna stay? Are you cuando gonna... la respuesta are... es, eh, por ejemplo, yes, I, I am gonna... Uh -huh. Y ahí aparece, y pues, él dice, este... Yo estaba haciendo unos ejemplos porque ahí los estaba viendo en internet. Uh -huh. De ahí aparecía entre paréntesis, not do. Not do. Ah, cuando es negativo. Ajá. Cuando es, I'm not going, I'm not going to do that. For example, I'm not going to play. I am not going to. They say, I am not going to study. I am not going to, I am not going to play. Pero ese es el not, el negativo. They say, I am not. Mmm, ya, yeah. es que no me había trabado porque mm -hmm. no lo podía. Resolver. You say, for example, are you going to, for example, are you going to dance on Friday, Fabiola? ¿Cómo? Are you going to dance on Friday? Yes. Yes? Okay. Yes. Si va a bailar, yes. lo quiero. Uh -huh. uh -huh. Yes, I am. Yes, I am. Okay, Janet, are you going to dance on Friday? No. No? No, no, no. I am not going to dance. Then, ah, excuse me, please, Janet. No, I, I'm not. No. Uh -huh. No, I, no, I am not going to dance. Going to dance. Okay, on Friday. Okay. Or no, I'm not Friday. going to dance on Friday. Uh -huh. Okay, uh -huh. in that case, you use the negative. Okay, for you. Okay. Podría ir el, 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 el gora. Mm -hmm. Yes. Always remember that. Cuando la gente habla, solo, a menos que sea algo bien, una plática formal en una película o algo, van a oír going to. Pero por lo general, toda la gente ya en la vida real va a usar gonna. Por ejemplo, are you gonna? Are you gonna, are you gonna have lunch today? Okay, are you gonna have a, a lunch tomorrow? Are you gonna have dinner? Are you gonna have breakfast? Eh, are you gonna have a, a party? Are you gonna celebrate your birthday? Okay. Are you going to travel this year? Okay. Uh, sería, no, I'm, I'm gonna not, no, no, I'm not gonna, mm -hmm. uh -huh. gonna go to play soccer. For exactly. Uh -huh. I'm not gonna go to play soccer this Sunday. Are you gonna play uh, soccer this Sunday? No, I'm not gonna play soccer this Sunday. No, are I'm you, not gonna play soccer this Sunday. Are mm -hmm. you gonna, are, are you gonna... Pupusas tonight. Are you gonna eat pupusas tonight? <laughs> no. La, ne no. Negativa, la ne negativa sentence. Are you gonna eat not? Huh? No. Eh, en la pregunta no es necesario. Lo crees. No. Uh -huh. are, you gonna eat pupu are you gonna eat pupusas tonight? En la respuesta. Yeah, say, no, Teacher, I'm, una pregunta. I'm not gonna eat pupusas tonight. Okay. Teacher, no. una pregunta. ¿Cómo se dice loroco? Loroco. Okay, loroco. Right? Ah. Hay unas que no tienen eh, eh, traducción porque son como bien, bien tropicales. Bien, son, son autóctonas ajá, bien, son, del algunas, lugar. No, algunas otras sí, ¿verdad? Pero, uh -huh. por ejemplo, papaya, a veces no, no Poteiro uh -huh. sí, pero algunas, algunas frutas o... o Avocaero. Avocaero, ajá, que yo uh -huh. Hay unas que sí, otras que no. Uh -huh. Ok, por ejemplo, loroco pupusas, o pupusas, por ejemplo, yo que no translate pupusas. No tienen traducción. Never. Es como sí. comer, es como, como comérselas con tenedor, no se puede. Ok. Es con los fingers, con los fingers, ¿verdad? Right? Uh -huh, okay. sí. Las de camarón son buenas. Ya. Yeah. Sí. Pero, pero Ayer dedos. hice de camarón. Con los dedos, nada de tenedores, ¿ok? Ok, sí. so you don't translate. Ok, you can translate trim, ¿ok? Uh, trim pupusas, ¿right? Because trim, you can translate. O you can say beans pupusas, o cheese pupusas, but you cannot translate the word pupusas. Okay, mm -hmm. loroco. Okay, loroco with cheese. Okay, or cheese with loroco, whatever. Okay, good. Cheese with chicharrón. 
with it, you're on it, right? <laughs> okay, continue practice, okay. right? Okay. okay, very good. Okay, hello, guys, questions? How's the practice here? Hello, hello. Hello, teacher. Okay, Gisela. Hello. 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 Okay, good. Are you practicing the questions? When is your birthday? Yes. 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 Okay. yes, yes. And then ask questions like, are you going to, right? Are you going to, are you going to play soccer this weekend, Ms. Are you gonna Yes, play? I am. Yes, I am. Okay. Uh, Yesenia, are you going to, are you going to have a party this weekend? No, I am not. No, I am not. Okay, good. Now, Grisela, are you going to drive that truck in the picture? No, I'm not. <laughs> okay, no, you're not going to drive. Can you drive? Hola? Can you drive? Can you drive? Uh, no. No, okay. No. Mm -mm. And that truck is yours? Is, is that truck, the truck in the picture, the pickup truck in the picture, is it yours? Ah, yeah. No, 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 no. <laughs> no, it's the port portazuelo. Oh, okay, good. So it's, it's only a picture, okay? Good. I yeah. thought it was in the family. Okay, good. No questions? No. No. Okay. Continue practicing a little bit more, and then we, in five minutes, we go back to the other station, okay? Okay. All right. Okay. Disculpe, no le escuché muy bien. Eh, su pregunta era, are you going to bank tomorrow or are you going to go? No, are you going to bank tomorrow? Es que como el coin to va unido al gonna. Entonces, are you going to bank tomorrow? Ah, okay. okay. Uh, are you going to go? Ah, okay. To the are you going to go to the bank? Are you going to go? To the bank. Sí. Yo, yo tenía esa duda. Uh -huh. Are you going to go to the bank tomorrow? Okay. Are you going to go to the bank tomorrow? Perfect. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Teacher, aprovechando que lo tenemos solo para nosotras. Oh, <laughs> nosotros, <go> perdón. <laughs> no, que yo les decía a los compañeritos que eso que usted nos puso así como de la pronunciación, escribiéndonos. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Eso que nos va a ayudar bastante, fíjese, sí. teacher. Ayuda, ¿Verdad? es que... Es sí, porque a veces uno se queda, si lo pronuncia, en cambio aquí como lo lees tal cual, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. Lo lees tal cual, entonces pienso que nos ayuda, teacher, ¿verdad? Yes, no problem. Cuando tenga dudas, let me know, ¿ok? okay. All right, Tatiana, okay. are you going to sing karaoke tonight? No, no. I'm not. <laughs> ok, good. Nancy told me que, that you are a good singer. No, no, it's not true. Um, Nancy, I don't know. Are you gonna are, are you gonna are you gonna sing tonight? No, I'm not. No, I'm not. Okay, good. Okay, so remember, are you going? Okay, lo que decía Verónica es cierto. O sea, cuando se dice gonna, ahí va el tú. Are you gonna? Pero después de ese gonna, tienen que poner el verbo principal de la acción que ustedes están preguntando. El going no, to solo el going to solo es vas a voy a pero la acción va después are you gonna dance are you gonna see are you gonna play are you gonna work are you gonna sleep are you gonna eat are you gonna ask ok siempre va un verbo ok are you gonna ask the teacher le vas a preguntar al profesor are you gonna ask the teacher are you gonna answer that question vas a responder esa pregunta are you gonna answer that question siempre Vas a ir al banco, ahí van doble, ahí va como go, go, right? Are you gonna go? Are you gonna, gonna go, go to the are, you bank. Gonna, are you gonna go to the bank? Are you gonna go to the park? Are you gonna go to the movies? Okay? Okay. Always. okay. That's always, okay? Very good. Ya casi regresamos, lo voy a visitar un par de grupos. Okay. Gracias. Okay. okay. <laughs> Gracias. All Thanks. Right. Okay. Questions, everybody? Anybody? Anybody has a question? No problem? No problem. Okay. Questions when when is your birthday? Are you gonna are you gonna stay? Are you gonna go? Uh, yes, and in the first day uh -huh. uh, 
the celebration day. Okay. When is Independence Day? Uh -huh. when, Independence Day. When is uh, Mother's Day? Uh -huh. When is Mother's Day? Okay, good. North Day. <laughs> huh? In when? the North the North Day. Ah, oh, the Nurses Day. When is the Nurses? Sí. Ah, the Nurses. Yeah. That's uh, another one, right? Uh, let me see what else. That's uh, what. Well, if you don't have no questions, okay, we'll return to the other group, to the main group, and I'll see you in a minute. Hello, teacher. Hello, teacher. Hello, Nancy. Hello, Lises. No questions? Everything is fine? No. Um, Very good, teacher. Okay, good. You have one minute to be famous in asking. Okay. <laughs> Thanks. Okay, good. Okay. The question is, are you going to write? Are you going to stay? Are you going to go? When is the yes. day? When is Independence Day? Clear. Um, okay. Okay. Very good. Okay. Okay, now we're going to go back to the main to the principal station. Okay, everybody's back. No se quedó nadie en la cafetería, no? All right, good. Okay, we have some minutes to check. Now in this one, in this other video, we are going to say by the end of this class, you will be able to talk about holidays in the USA, right? This is what I was showing you yesterday also. Okay, some celebrations in the United States. Hi, everyone. In this class, you learn vocabulary related to holidays in the US. Let's go to my Holidays in the US. New Year's Day. January 1st. Valentine's Day. February 14th. Independence Day. July 4th. Halloween. October 31st. Thanksgiving. Fourth Thursday in November. Christmas. December 25th. Now, I'd like for you to use the vocabulary to talk about your plans for this coming holidays. For example, Valentine's Day is going to be on February 14. I'm going to invite my wife to a special restaurant. Write similar sentences as this one. The goal is to use the vocabulary and going to. After you finish this task, share discussion forms okay like as you can see here the soldier the soldier's day is on may 7. i'm going to go to the parade and then here the father's day is on june 17. i'm gonna go to a restaurant with my father okay so please uh write more sentences here right and, and share 
for example, Mother's Day, it will be, uh, here has to be on, on May 10th. Remember that always before the month, vamos a poner el on, okay, on, okay, on, ma on May 10th. I'm going to invite my mother to a special restaurant. Okay, aquí le voy a poner unos comments and then ustedes hagan otras oraciones para... I am gonna, sería ahí, teacher. Perdón? Ahí sería, I am gonna uh -huh. invite. I'm gonna invite, I'm gonna invite uh -huh. my mother to a special restaurant. Aquí este tú está de más, pero aquí I'm gonna. I'm gonna invite my mother to a special restaurant. Uh -huh. Okay, Valentine says, uh, will be... Aquí el, el Valentine's Day y el eat está acá, no es necesario. Valentine's Day will be on February 14th. Recuerden que cuando usamos fechas, usamos on February 14th. Y acá, I'm gonna. I'm gonna invite, I'm gonna invite my girlfriend, right? I'm gonna invite my girlfriend to a fancy restaurant. Okay, good. You got it. Okay, acá pueden ustedes escribir otros ejemplos para que, para que practiquen. Okay, no importa si hay errorcitos o lo que sea, la idea es eh, practice, okay, to practice more. Good. Now let's see this one. Alan, can you please read this objective here? By then, by the end of this class, you will be able to ask an answer with WH WH question using by gonna or is be be going to be going to okay be going to additional ad, additionally 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 mm -hmm. you will practice a conversation which which illustrates how this topic is used in a real real life setting. In a real life setting. Okay. ¿Cómo se usa ya realmente esto en la vida real? Hi everyone. In this class, you'll learn how to ask and answer the huge questions using one two. Additionally, you'll practice a conversation which illustrates how this topic is used in a real life setting. Let's get started by listening and practicing the conversation titled, Have a Good Valentine's Day. So, Tyler, are you going to do anything special for Valentine's Day? Yeah, I'm going to take my girlfriend. Uh -huh. Oh, really? Where are you going to go? Lagunas. It's her favorite restaurant. Oh, she's going to like that. How about you? What are you going to do? Well, I'm not going to go to a restaurant, but I am going to go to a dance. Sounds like fun. Well, have a good Valentine's Day. Thanks. You too. Now let's analyze the example that you see on this chart. WH questions with be going to. What are you going to do for Valentine's Day? I'm going to go to a dance. Yeah, yeah. I'm going to go to a restaurant. Where are you going to go? We're going to go to Lagunas. We're not going to stay home. How are you going to get there? We're going to drive. We're not going to take a bus. Who's going to be there? My friends are going to be there. My sister isn't going to be there. In order to form WH questions with be going to, we can follow this formula. WH word plus verb to be plus the subject plus going to plus verb plus complement. Let's analyze a couple of these questions using this formula. What are you going to do for Valentine's Day? The WH word is was. Next, we have the verb to be are, then we have the subject, you, 
after that, we add going to. Then we have the verb do. And finally, we put the complement and a question mark at the end for Valentine's Day. Let me choose one more example. How are you going to get there? The WH word is how. Next, we have the verb to be are. Then we have the subject, you. After that, we need to add going to. Then we have the verb get and finally we put the compliment and a question mark at the end there now it's your turn to practice making wh questions with be going to i would like for you to make similar questions about the upcoming holidays in your country after you complete this activity share your work in our discussion Okay, guys. In the in the chat, I in the WhatsApp chat, I sent you the the image. The WH word is have. Okay, this one. Ahí tienen ya en el chat esta imagen para que para mañana, por favor, hagan preguntas similares a esta. What are you gonna do for Valentine's Day? What are you going to give me? Okay, what are you going to give me for Valentine's Day? What are you going to do for Christmas? What are you going to do for Independence Day? What are you going, uh, where are you going to go, uh, let's say, uh, let's say uh, on the weekend? Uh, where are you going to study next year? Where are you going to work when you learn English? Hagan cuatro preguntas usando what, where, how, and who. Y mañana las vamos a practicar en los grupos, ¿ok? Las preguntas okay. que ustedes elaboren, ¿ok? Good. Sure? Esta es la... Son similares a estas que estuvieron leyendo acá al inicio. Si gusta. Y esa la pueden mandar, Tisho. Esta no, esta está en la web, pero ahorita lo que voy a hacer es en el chat. Les voy a pegar el link uh -huh. para que lo pueda para que ahí lo puedan copiar ustedes y ya puedan accesar mañana o cuando puedan ahí está okay. el link y ahí lo va a llevar a este y aquí hay un montón de ejercicios ok alright es como una thank you alright ya lo pueden pegar ustedes ahí o que les quede ya grabado y así les voy a ir dando otros links de otros temas para que tengan Aquí están todas las preguntas. Miren, when is, todo lo que estaban hablando ahí de eh, questions with WH. Entonces, ahí pueden tener ustedes mucha práctica. Ok. Y de ahí pueden sacar ideas para las preguntas de mañana. Why, por qué, cuánto, how much are they going to pay. Ok. Solo así rapidito, esto ya no, esto lo vamos a ver, esta es que sí, la vamos a ver mañana, solo quiero ver algo que me preguntaba Saúl. Ah, pero Saúl se salió, me acaba de mandar acá. Sí, se sentía mal. Ahí, ahí sí, tengo, tengo problemas, problema. yo también. Sí, me acaba de decir que se, se salió. Para que 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 ahí, ya. no sé qué es lo que íbamos a poner ahí. Bueno, pero este, lo vemos mañana al inicio, no problem. Esto bueno. Ahí. Y vamos a comenzar mañana y las preguntas que tenemos y seguimos. Okay. Okay. Thank you so much, everybody. Have a very good night. Okay. Good night, teacher. Bye. Good night, teacher. Good night. Good night. La tarea de todos los días es que sueñen en inglés. Good night. Good night. Bye. Very good. Very good. Yes. Okay. Bye bye. Good night. Bye bye. Good night. Bless you. Thank you, man.